Yeah, so what you don't want to do is you don't want to just be summarizing or reporting on the text or giving an infomercial on the text, giving information on it. We have all read the text. We've read the same text, right? And what you're doing is highlighting a part of the text and then giving your, your, your argument, uh, your ideas. So you, need, you do need to, um, of course, a report on the text and summarize it to yourself, but that's not something that you write about in a public discussion or you would speak in a seminar. Okay, it doesn't need to be done, okay, and so you don't want to do that, okay. And so you want to make an argument and you want to make an argument in the text and that's, sort of, that's what's missing here, right. We don't see a lot of the text, uh, we don't see specific aspects of this text. Here in the second one, again, the souls of black folk, okay? So again, you know, this is, um, you know, just a little bit of respect, right? So we all like to be uh, referred to by, you know, our given name or accepted name and uh, pronounced correctly and all that stuff. So uh, a little bit of respect by uh, citing the text uh, the way it should be cited. Uh, and so in this one, uh, again, the, the author's name is misspelled. Uh, we're talking about double consciousness at first. Here's some general thoughts and then goes to the chapter, uh, Washington chapter, and then goes to the sixth chapter, okay? The argument was, um, you know, to, or the prompt was to pick out a specific section of the text and work that. Try, you don't, you want to get out of this rut, right, of covering the text, of talking about everything in the text, right? This prompt was isolate a specific part and then analyze that. If you isolate a specific part, then you can start to talk about it on a critical, rigorous level, not just do description. When you do coverage, you're always doing description, you're never doing analysis, okay? And sure enough, we see here at the end, the person does... Uh, the respondent here does not, um, only has one sentence, right, where there's really any type of argumentative sort of move here, right, and it's way too late. This is where the discussion board should begin, right, um, and so, you know, you need to work, we all need to work on that here, right. Let's see here, uh, again, uh, here at the end, uh, we have three or four sentences. This is where the argument begins, right. And so here I've located some, you know, questions, right? So at the end, the author does a good job of starting to talk about things, but again, too late, too little, too late.